All right, back for match four here. Let's see if our luck still continues to hold up. Uh, we beat a blue, black, strange, for an alchemy. No, 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 blue, black, like Delver deck. I don't quite know what it is. We beat, we beat a deck wins deck. And we beat a. Uh, And we beat, uh, what we beat? We beat a uh, red, black, and range. Yeah, it's about a hand. Risky keep, but. Uh, especially if our opponent just has spell stutter. Ooh. That's a very good draw for us. One just bolts. I don't know what our opponent is playing. So I'm just going to brainstorm right now. I know that I'm looking for lands. Dispel. Sure. Uh, I don't know what we're facing. Maybe this is, um, is it Blitz? <laughs> All right, our deck, our deck is rewarding us today. Okay, it's, oh, Tron deck of some sort? I'm really confused. Seagate Oracle. See if we can guarantee a auger hit. We can't. So I'm actually going to shuffle. I'm not too sure how good spell swords are in this matchup, and I'll try to dig for a land again. Uh, nope. Definitely not at the point which I need to hold up. Oh, actually, our opponent might just be playing the bigger blue black fairies. Hmm. In that case, I will just play Augur. See if he counters this. It does. And so I can resolve a pre day now. So looking for land. Okay, we found it. Okay, so our opponent might be playing the bigger... What? I'm very confused. That's good. Drifter. Mm. Yeah, let me just use my mana here. And we'll probably just be ninjaing. Uh, I will just hold that land. Firebolt. Uh, opponent has a counterspell? I think I'm okay with that. Because that means I can both a Seagate. Mana leak. Very 
Very strange deck our opponent's playing here. We're flooding out a bit. Scred. I'll play one of my lands. Augur. Accumulate knowledge. Okay, so it looks like our opponent is playing a very controlish blue red deck. All right, that's unfortunate. We are out of gas. Hopefully our opponent is as well. Another to my knowledge. And we're just still drawing lands. Hmm. Ponder's very nice. So I'm going to brainstorm next turn to hopefully find a shuffle. But, uh, I think I'm just fine just waiting it out here. Both Mold Drifter. I'm okay with that. Brainstorms left? No. So I might as well just put out my lands. While I'm drawing lands, I don't think there's any reason to act. My opponent is full of full of cards. We can just wait until our hand gets better. So I'm not going to cast Gush yet. I will just let this pre go. Very miscreant. Still don't think I have to act yet. So I'll just still wait a little bit more. Well, it's good. Beetleback Chief. All right, let me gush.
That's another gush. Mm. Yeah, let me just counter this. Trade off with one of his counter spells. That's fine. Doesn't do anything. All right, it is time for us to act. Let's try to guarantee an auger hit. No, but these are very good cards. Very miscreant. Very miscreant. How is it? Mm. Can't stop that. I know we have a fairy miscreant on top, but I'm still just going to run this auger out. Kind of spell. Nice. Good hit. And we don't have to discard. All right. Harvest Pyre. Mm. Let me just try to counter that with Spell Setter. Lightning Bolt. Sure, I will counter that. Okay, this is fine. Guys, okay. Mm. Let's go Moltres for right now. Then we'll see who has a better late game. Want well, to just play some sort of blue red control deck? Spell starter is good. Our opponent's flooding out here, hopefully. Ooh, gush. Well, we will cast gush. I'll counter that. Ooh, spell stutters. Those are very good. Okay, we'll run out one of the spell setters. Delver, also a good card. Ooh. 
have bolts now. Let's see what our opponent does with this storm down, guys. Mm, deep analysis. Can't stop that. Still can't stop that. I'll try to counter that with my spell starter. Oh. That is very good. It has an auger. Finds accumulated knowledge. Alright, well, we'll just bolt the auger. Nope. And we'll just shuffle. So this, I have no lands left, but I still don't want to draw that card. Ninja. Okay. That sounds good. Spells a nice card. We'll be trying to, I guess, dispel his accumulated knowledge. Mm -hmm. yeah, let's try to do that. On the sun. Okay, I can't stop that. Auger. Dane. Probably can't cast that. Fireball's a ninja. We'll play another Stormman, guys. Well, let me bolt the auger. Nope. Can't flip. So let me just attack. Ninja's a pretty good draw. Drifter. Uh, I'll just chomp at this point. Nope. Nope. We're just going to attack with everything. So our opponent is out of lightning bolts.
Let's see what has rolling thunder. Oh. oh, are you serious? Am I recording this? I am. What? <laughs> oh my god. Whoa. I can't believe that just happened. Our opponent drew his entire deck and couldn't kill me. I mean, admittedly, we were drawing a lot of cards too, but... That is pretty absurd. I mean, our opponent probably has a ghostly flicker that he couldn't cast because he's just going to deck himself. Hmm. Alright, so our opponent is playing... Augers, Seagates, Mole Drifters. Instrument guys with a ton of removal and a ton of card draw. So Pyro Blast is definitely good. I don't think I want any of my removal. Mm, I don't like days in these matchups because they can usually play around it. And I guess I take a relic. I can also take a Hydro Blast. That card doesn't seem like it does too much. Relic is good against Accumulated Knowledge, Fire, Fire Bolt, and kind of good against Tormund Geist, if I can maneuver the game into that position. Uh, Did my other cards do anything? Hydro Blast doesn't do too much. Because it just counts burn spells. I think Delver is better. So, yeah, let's try this. Our augers are going to be pretty bad. But hopefully, you know, we'll be casting cantrips into them so that we can guarantee hits. <clears throat> okay, this is a good start. Uh Hmm. Let me see. I, I don't think I really want to play for a miscreant because uh This is better, on the other hand. Mm -hmm. I kind of want to get value off of it. Here, our pun is representing a counterspell. Okay. That is fine. Given that our pun does have red mana, I will just play this Fairy Miscreant. When it's missing again, so I will just I will just play it slow as well. Hold up both spell setter and counter spell. And I will continue to play it slow. I don't know if there's any reason why I need both. Kind of spell 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 sort of this turn, but I will I will just do that. I found something. All right. Well, we will just counter this. All right. Will we? 
I need a discard. Uh, I'll just let this happen. Blast. Ooh, Fury Miscreant. Excellent. Mm. Yeah, I'll still just hold up all my cards up. Another mold drifter. Okay. I'm okay with this because he's just he's kind of discard. And these are just draw twos. They're just divinations. Alright, my opponent still has no red mana. Still discarding. Now discard an auger. Uh, yeah, auger. Alright. We can guarantee a counter spell hit, and so we will do so. Yep. We mainly need to stop Mold Drifters, though he's gone through two of them. Stormbound Geist. Uh, I will try to stop that with the Spell Stutter. My opponent almost assuredly has a counter. But that's okay. Because we can just start chipping in with this Augur. Ooh, that's a good card. And a Stormbound Geist of our own. It still hasn't found a red mana source. Human knowledge is fine. It's just a draw one. It's just a cycle. And it still has no red mana. I will try to counter this again. Works this time. So, kind of an interesting spot here. I wonder if our opponent, I mean, Seems kind of absurd that our opponent just doesn't have red mana. Ooh. That look is good. I will just attack, and then if he blocks, I will cycle relic. Otherwise, I will just start exiling cards from his graveyard. Found his red mana. I'm gonna, I'm gonna use a counter spell here because I think Power Blast is a little bit more flexible. Another Storm Mountain, guys. Very nice. Yeah, looks like our opponent just found red mana. Way too late. Force and was forced to kind of like dump these mole drifters. Now he's in pretty rough shape. Oh, right. conceded. All right. Um. So yeah, you know, I think. Delver decks in general are kind of good against these these decks, these like control decks, because all your creatures are two for ones, and all their removal spells for the most part are one for ones, unless they have like stuff like electricity. Uh, and Delver is proactive, whereas these control decks are reactive. So it's like a 
basically, right, so they have to line up their cards against your threats, whereas from Delver's side, you just need to play stuff. <clears throat> and if they screw up, you know, they if they if they either don't find the right threats or they something like this happens, they're really far behind. Whereas from the you know kind of the proactive side, you don't really care what you draw because they're just gonna play everything you draw anyways. So you don't you don't need to worry about this like lining up your threats against the answers business. So I think that Delver decks are just in general good against these control decks. I mean I would suspect that this deck is just not that's great in the current metagame. Stompy's probably a bit too fast. Moldrifters, you can't tap out for Moldrifters. And it kind of probably just gets it gets beat by Delver. It just probably does beat the, the mid-range decks, but it probably doesn't even do well against Torture Existence. So, hmm, I wouldn't suspect this deck is very good right now, the Blu-ray Control deck, but it's definitely kind of sweet. Alright, GG's.